How's it going guys? It is first thing in the morning. It is already hot out. Uh, it has been miserably hot here for the last couple days. It's actually put me behind because it's been hard to get all this mowing done by myself with it being this hot. Uh, so I'm going out today to uh, catch up from some of yesterday's stuff. But I thought I would real quick shoot this little video because Skag sent me a little package and I kind of wanted to do like a mail time type thing and open it for you guys and show y'all. Uh, I did cover up my address. It's my home address. Um, if you are interested in sending me something, there is a P.O. Box address in the description. You can send it there. I'd be glad to open it on camera. They did tell me that they sent it because uh, they sent me an email telling me that they were sending this. Uh, they said they sent it because uh, I bought the new mower and I did the video about it and they appreciate it kind of thing. So I thought I'd just open it and see what's inside. Looks like there's a nice Skag hat. There's also a little Skag notebook here with a, with a pen on the side. There's also a uh, Skag patch and another Skag pen. So I appreciate Skag for sending me this stuff. Uh, that's really cool of them. So just a little update on the WorkTunes wireless. Uh, I put that video up I guess about three weeks ago and uh, I had put fresh batteries in it on that day that I made the video. Um, and yesterday it started telling me that the batteries were low, so I might have to change out the batteries. I have not bought the rechargeable ones like I talked about, so I'm just gonna pick up some cheap batteries and change them out to those. I feel like, you know, three weeks, that's pretty good uh, for the batteries to last. I've used them quite a bit. Uh, I still really like them. Uh, they've been great headset. Uh, the Bluetooth connects real easy. I would definitely tell anybody to just go buy these. I know they're kind of pricey, but I think they're gonna last a long time. They work great. They sound pretty good. The volume could be a little louder. That's probably my only complaint. But other than that, man, they work great. I did have a bunch of people ask me about the antenna. Uh, I just zip tied it down like that because I didn't like it sticking up, just thought it looked dumb. Um, just personal preference, or me being weird. finished the video from yesterday uh, it just got so hot out I ended up just putting the cameras down and just trying to get my day done and didn't even worry about filming um, I'm gonna try to continue it today uh, so this video is gonna be kind of a combination of several days just kind of thrown together so if it doesn't flow right I'm sorry but it is what it is as you can see I'm trying out a different shirt uh, if you've ever watched Southern Style Lawn Care, he had a tip on there about these like fishing style shirts that you can get at Academy and uh, said they were really cool to wear and that they uh, dried real quick. Uh, the green shirts I normally wear are an all cotton shirt. So once you sweat in them, they just hold that sweat and then you just walk around feeling wet the rest of the day. So I'm gonna test out one of these shirts. Um, Hopefully Southern Style Lawn Care guy is right. I'm sorry, I don't know your name. Um, but if you haven't heard of him, I'll link him in the description and uh, go check out his channel. Sub him if you want to. 
but uh, he's got some good tips on there. I am done for the day. I definitely have to give these shirts like uh, two thumbs up. Pretend like there's two thumbs here. Um, they are awesome shirts. I'm definitely gonna be going to Academy, get some more of these. Uh, it was real nice because you weren't in a wet shirt the rest of the day after you've been sweating. These things would dry out in the time that it took me to drive from one location over to another location. So every time I got to you know a new yard, it felt like I had a fresh shirt on because it had dried out. So I'm gonna kind of uh, go against what I've talked about with the uniforms and you know go with these shirts for now while it's hot. When it starts cooling off I may go back to the t-shirts but I mean something like this in this kind of heat whenever it's a heat index of 110 you just do what you got to do to stay cool and if that's going out of uniform you know I still got the hat on so it is what it is. So guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.